All right, recording. Recording yourself as well. Mike! Tony! Hello! How, how are you doing? Yeah, you're know, okay. You know, doing all right. How are you doing? I, I'm just sort of amazed that we're here in the same room together after all these years. It's been a while. It's been a long time. I think we used to do an intro for these things, but I don't remember how it went. Uh, like usually there was some music and then... There was a thing and then it was like all bombastic and you know, and then we had like the lines, but who cares? None of that matters. We can't call this one developer commentary. No, we absolutely cannot. I think this is just two idiots talking about a game that they have no business talking about. Okay, that's what it'll be called. Yeah, I, that's a great snappy <laughs> title. Put it right there at the bottom of the video, and everybody's gonna be like, "Wow, how can I not watch this?" And then we can put our, our faces on the YouTube icon, like with yeah, cra- reacting crazy like really weird. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, it's okay. perfect, excellent, no problem. Hit that algorithm. So yeah, this is uh, Ratchet and Clank Rift Apart, and two idiots talking about Ratchet and Clank uh, Rift Apart. And if you haven't. Uh, if you haven't sussed this out yet, neither Tony nor I worked on this game. No. Uh, but that is not to say that we are objective. Because we are absolutely not objective on this one. No, I'm expecting to love this. Yes. We both do have friends, I think, that have worked on this game mm-hmm. still. Uh, even though we did not work on it uh, ourselves. Yeah. So, uh, we decided that we're both very excited for this game. Yep. And we both really wanted to play it. So we're just going to do a stupid little thing and play this game and talk about how great this game is. Because I do also expect it to be very, very good. But neither of us have played any of it yet. Right. Yeah. This is this is our first shot. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to have the controller. So I, I apologize to everybody. You know how bad I am at playing these. Uh, you, can, you can wince. Maybe I'll hand it over to Tony. But... Uh, since this is your PS4, Tony, I appreciate that you letting me. Oh, excuse me. Ooh, PlayStation Since this is 5. Your PlayStation Five. Uh, Tony's kind enough to let me play so that I can get a chance because I don't have one. Right. So yeah, I think it should be pretty fun. Uh, one thing, I guess, before we want to get started, I do want to talk about really quickly. Uh, again, since neither of us have played, neither of us have too many expectations. I think going in. Except for the fact that it's going to be the greatest Amazing. game ever. Yes. Yeah. So it's low expectations. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Reasonable, nice low Sounds expectations. Sounds reasonable to me. From what you've seen so far, uh, what are you most excited about seeing in this game? Ten out of ten. Oh wait. Uh, no, it's. Uh, uh, I'm going to be honest with you. Uh-huh. I want to see references to the shit that I did. Okay. Uh, back on the PS2 game. Okay. Yes. I hear that they did do a bunch of references on there. Uh, I imagine we're going to miss some and people are going to get mad at us saying how stupid we are. But we've already put out at the front that we're a bunch of idiots. Yeah. So yeah, strokes on you, buddy. It was on the tin. Yeah. (laughs) Uh, Yeah, the other thing uh, I'm looking forward to, I think, is uh, I've heard of the kind of magic they were able to accomplish with the faster hard drive speeds. Mm -hmm. And I just sort of want to see what that's like. Okay. Uh, I, I also only used this controller for the first time yesterday, so seeing how the weapons work with the, the uh, haptics is going to be interesting. What okay. about you, Tony? Uh, so, number one for me is Rivet. Yeah, oh, uh, yeah, of course, Rivet. Can't wait to see Rivet. Uh, very excited about that character. Uh, Ratchet, garbage, trash character <laughs> at this point. Uh, give me 100% Rivet, uh, as far as I'm concerned. But I like Ratchet. Uh, he's fine. He's no rivet. <laughs> uh, anything else you're looking forward to? Uh, no, I think similar to you. Uh, I think when this is the part that I'm, I'm, I'm kind of curious about, there are definitely a lot of parts about Ratchet and Clank, uh, and especially Ratchet and Clank 2, which it sounds like this is going to have a lot of throwback references to, that are very important to me that I can't imagine are very important to other people. Oh, yeah? Um... So if I see some of that stuff come through and I see some references of stuff that I think does hold a special place in my heart, uh, that'll be very exciting. Are there, are there any of those things that just come to mind initially? Well, the, one, the, one, the obvious one is something like the Yetis. Yeah, uh, right? The Yetis mean a lot to me, but I can't imagine <laughs> they mean a lot to a lot of people. The snow beasts. Um, 
And then the other thing, and if this goes without saying, uh, Dr. Nefarious. Yes, uh, but we great, know. amazing character. Yeah. Uh, I can't wait to see what they do with him in this one. And, uh, and then, I guess, I suppose I want to see if they have an Insomniac Museum. Yes. Yeah, that'll be fun. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, I think we're all ready to get started. And thank you for bearing with us in the intro. And uh, let's take it from here. <laughs>